One burst. <laughs> I'll take you on. Look out! Thanks for piping up back there. I mean it. The name's Tara. It's nice to meet you, Tara. What are you nuts running out onto the course like that? Yeah, that's against the rules. I'm sure you had your reasons, but I can't say that I approve either. Well, rules don't apply when you're up against the unversed. Rules don't apply? You sound just like Pete. Look, it's Captain Dark. Disguised in shadows, the rogue racer reigns. Mm -hmm. I am Captain Dark. And you must be the chump who made me miss a new track record. Hold on. How's come I don't know you? Somebody bringing in a ringer? Ah, oh, I'm not even a racer. Must be downright temptatious to try and stop a primo racer like me from getting a record, but we all gotta play by the rules, rookie. Now, just a second. You're the no-good cheater who's always breaking the rules. Well, I can't say racing interests me, but I need to defeat the unversed. Tell me what I've got to do. Are you talking about all those carts that look like scary, ugly monsters? Hmm. Hmm. Well, we've only ever seen the monsters on the track. That's it! Tara, you just need to enter the races. And while you're at it, take that Captain Dark down a notch or two. He's always breaking the rules and causing trouble. I have to become a racer? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Now I'm sure I don't have to tell you. I know. I'll play by the rules. Oh. Yay! Tara's gonna be a new racer! Just come talk to me whenever you're ready. I'll get you signed up and everything.
thunder! Thunder!
Oh, my cart must have sprung a spring. You yahoos just wait. Next time, I'll clobber all of you. Pete? Vote? What are you talking about? Chip means the Million Dreams Award. It's a very popular part of our dream festival. Everyone in town votes for who we think is the most exemplary citizen. And since everybody knows how much of a troublemaker Pete is, he probably figured wearing a disguise was the only way he'd get any votes. No votes, no prize. Yeah, the prize is all he really wants anyway. He doesn't care about being a good citizen. Oh, I think that's very sad. The award is supposed to help us appreciate how much we all look out for each other every day. Well, one thing I know for sure, I'm voting for Terra. Your racing really saved the day against those monster carts. Hip, hip, hooray for Terra! <laughs> well, I got something out of it, too. I learned that you don't always have to bend the rules to reach your goals. Oh. All this time, I've been staring into the darkness. But that doesn't mean I have to jump in. Who do you think's gonna win this year's Million Dreams Award? Boy, oh boy! I hope it's the guy I voted for! I voted for him, too! Now that we got so much business at the shop, maybe we'll be number one! Wow, Huckus could sure would be proud of us if we actually won! Yeah, and I bet after that would be pretty surprised, too! Hello, everyone, and thank you for waiting. Now it's time to begin the main event of our Dream Festival. The Million Dreams Award Presentation. <laughs> Just skip to the part where you say my name. This is a shoe in Oh, how very exciting! This year, we have multiple winners. The Million Dreams Award goes to... Ventus, Aqua, and Tara. All three of you. <laughs> <laughs> Are they here now? What do you mean? <laughs> There's gotta be a mistake. Everybody voted for Captain Justice. I made sure. Now go on, tell her. No. Oh. <laughs> Better try the other one. The Rogue Racer, Captain Dark. We counted the votes very carefully. Ventus, Aqua, and Terra won. Oh, Pete, I think you tried to do something good, but you were doing it for the wrong reasons, and you went about it the wrong way. Still, a couple of citizens must have thought you had goodness in you because you actually got a few votes. They knew you were looking out for them. Big whoop. I don't need their lousy votes. Just cough up my prize. Pete! They voted for you because they believe in you and care about you. How could you look down on that? I've tried to forgive a lot of things you've done, but this is too much. Now you finally crossed the line. Like that matters to me. Besides, what are you going to do about it? Huh. I'm going to let you cool off for a while. Wait, wait, what? Hey, let me go. Put me down. What? No, you can't. No, no, no. Hey, easy. Ow! Now, shall we continue the ceremony? With the three winners, Ventus, Aqua, and Terra, Please come up and join me on the stage. Oh dear, it looks
Looks like our other two winners couldn't make it here to be with us today. Oh. Perhaps you would accept the award on their behalf. After all, you've been so kind to so many here at the Dream Festival. So now, I hereby present the Million Dreams Award as a token of how much you matter to us. Congratulations! <laughs> Thanks. And as an extra treat, we've created something special. An ice cream flavor just for you. Rock and Crunch ice cream. Oh my, I wish I had my own ice cream flavor. What's it taste like? Go on, try it. What do you think? Hmm, this is fantastic. Oh, we're all very glad you're enjoying it. No, who does she think she is to be in a place like this? Well, I'll just bust out of here and. Quite fool. You do not possess that kind of power. Who's there? Show yourself! That is enough. Stop your sniveling and heed my words. Um, okay. If you do exactly as I say, I may decide to release you from this prison. Really? Oh, then you can count on me. Just get me out of here, and you can tell me what to do. A very wise choice indeed. Proceed. With your help, soon every world in existence 